Bestiality Complex. Once, there was a man who owned a sheep. However, this was a very attractive sheep. So attractive, in fact, that the man was wanting to marry it. So the man went to a registry office. However, when he got there, the attendant said he couldn't marry the sheep, as it was not human, and this was socially unacceptable. The man was indignant. He said the attendant was being speciest. On this, the attendant changed his tune and asked whether the sheep wanted to marry the man. With a bit of neuroanalysis, analysis, the attendant found that indeed the sheep did not want to marry the man. However, the man brought the argument up that he was also allowed under law to eat the sheep if he wanted to, and asked if a neuroanalysis analysis showed that the sheep would be happy about this too. On examination, he found that the sheep would prefer not to be eaten either, and so the attendant had to assume that it was also socially unacceptable for the man to eat the sheep as well. So the man went home with the sheep, unable to do anything with it, except maybe give it the occasional hug. When the man got back home, he found that he had a cockroach problem and decided to do a bit of extermination. But before he started, he remembered what the attendant had said and decided to do some more neuroanalysis to see if the cockroaches were happy to be exterminated. The results were that they were not, making this socially unacceptable and so the man had to learn to live with them. After all this, the man decided to have a shower. But then he thought that by doing so, the bacteria on his body would be killed off. And so the scientist was called in to do some neuroanalysis to see if the bacteria wanted to be killed in the interest of hygiene. As with the other experiments, they were not. So the attendant said that it would be socially unacceptable for the man to shower. However, from not showering, the man started to smell and got bacteria poisoning. He complained to the attendant, and he conceded on this and allowed the man to have his shower. After this victory, the man went back to the cockroach problem and said, I need to exterminate these cockroaches, otherwise they will attract the bacteria. And thus, the attendant had to allow this too. Then the man went further by saying he'd been allowed to kill these animals, so why not the sheep, as he needed to eat it for vital protein chains for his diet anyway. So the attendant had to concede on this point. And finally, the man gave the ultimate argument. I need to marry the sheep because I can't find a human female who wants to marry me. With this, the attendant had to accept it, even if it was against the sheep's will. And so the man married the sheep and they lived happily ever after. Well, actually, that is a lie. It only lasted about two months, and then the sheep decided to go off with a duck, leaving the man all alone. However, as he had argued that it was socially acceptable to eat the sheep and the duck, he decided he would have a slap-up meal of mutton and duck, and so the man finally found his happiness. The End